Yeah. My turbo's leaking oil. If you find your turbocharger leaking oil, stop. Don't just throw a turbocharger at it. 99% of the time it's something else causing the turbo to start leaking. I get calls all the time about turbochargers leaking oil and they say typically that the seal must have gone bad. But there's not really a seal like we think in a traditional sense inside a turbo. We actually use piston rings. These piston rings help control oil from leaking out one side or the other. But that's just part of the equation. We really rely on equal pressure on both sides of the turbo, on the turbine side and on the compressor side. If we have one PSI here, we should also have one PSI here. This is going to allow the oil that flows into the inlet through the bearings to be able to drain out the bottom and not want to go out either side of the turbo. Let's say we find oil on the compressor side of the unit. We should always be focusing on the other side. Check for restrictions in our exhaust. Check for restricted after treatment system if it's on a diesel. One other thing about the compressor side that you can check very easily is maybe you had a family of squirrels moving your air cleaner. If you get a restricted air cleaner, something that simple can cause it to create a vacuum and suck oil out of the compressor side. If we have oil coming out of the exhaust side of our unit, we need to focus on the compressor side. Maybe we have a collapsed ductwork. Maybe we have a restricted intercooler. Any of those things can cause oil migration. Now let's talk about oil on both sides of the system. Very commonly what happens here is we have excessive crankcase pressure. Oil has to get into the unit and it has to get out. If we have excessive pressure on the drain side, the oil will pool inside the unit and start to migrate out both sides. Remember, if you take one thing away from this video, if your turbocharger is leaking oil, stop. Look elsewhere. And if you do have to change your turbocharger, make sure you change your air filter, change your engine oil, and pre-lube the unit. If you enjoyed this video, click like at the bottom and subscribe. This has been another Tech Tip. Thanks for watching.